All right, so what's up guys? I'm, I'm planning on making this little 18 inch BMX bike into a drift trike. And because of this, it's already braced at the head tube. Um, I'm gonna cut down here and cut down here and take out this whole seat tube area. And then hopefully a cut here and on the other side too. And then cut a little triangle piece right here, maybe. I don't know, I'm not a metal fabricator, but hopefully it'll bend down and I can um, brace the middle part up so it doesn't bend. We're gonna flip the handlebars around, fix the tire, it's flat, one of those. Uh, and yeah. So I'm just gonna keep cutting through this. I already started. It'll focus right there. I already start cutting through. I already cut through these. Then after I cut through this, at the head tube, I mean the top tube, I'm gonna cut the seat tube right there, right here, somewhere. I don't know, I don't measure, because it's just a for fun build. And I want to do this because I don't want to pay for a drift track, I'd rather build one to get experience, and I don't have much experience with metal work, and there's not gonna be any welding with this, because I don't have a welder. It would have taken me like two hours to cut. Oh, focus. Holy shit, that's hella thick pipe. Good for support. Got the axle in place. Just a 5 8 threaded rod. Some block washers. Oh, let's try to cut these halfway down and bend it down to here. Okay, cool. About halfway. Cut through. Okay, so what I've done is I've taken off the upper part of the triangle. I've hammered it flat, flat enough, and I'm just self-tapping the screws, using self-tapping screws and screwing it in. Okay, so I don't know where I last left off, but here's the drift trike now. It's almost put together. It's just gotta bolt the seat down. And make sure the wheels are on. So I'll do that. So the drift trike is finished. I don't know how to hold the seat together, but it's good enough. 